you jump on that bike. All right, hands on the controls. Yeah, just go from throttle to brake. Fingers up too. All right, now jump on this R1. Throttle to brake. Throttle to brake. What do you notice is different on this bike? This is more like slanted down in a way. The handlebars? Yeah. Yes. But yeah. what about the controls? Everything's more like closer. Reach out or... What else are you noticing? Something Go from throttle to brake again. Throttle. Brake. I'll get back on the R6. From throttle to brake. This is more like down that way. Bingo. <laughs> it's more comfortable <clears throat> for you to be in the mix. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then when it's time to brake, boom. Whereas this one is like. So you got hug to it. Which means that when you turn your hand back this way, what are you doing? Yeah. The thing with this bike is the banjo bolt or the bolt that goes on the bottom of the master is right up on the fork. So I can't really rotate that down. But what they used to do is there was like a block. You couldn't rotate that any further. This one, it doesn't have it. So we can actually adjust that out to move that down. So that's the plan. We're just gonna loosen up the, the brake master so that I can Really move it around to adjust it. All right, so that way we can move it around a little more freely. Hold it. Yep. I hate doing this the way I'm doing it right now because it is dripping, but. I will pump the brakes back up here shortly. Okay. So that's down a little bit more. Uh, possibly could go more but it looks like it's just the way that the brake line is is uh curled yeah it's it's curled down into the shock we could probably bend it out but i don't want to twist or break or put a stress fracture in the brake line and since we did kind of crack the brake line it shouldn't have lost any pressure because we just barely cracked it a little better it could be much better but that's because of the brake line that is a little bit better and this is interesting because uh i've always you know heard people talk about doing this but i never really cared because i just use how the bikes come the most i adjust is suspension and stuff and then other than that i just change how i ride to figure out whatever else but I rode Jay's bike, um, I was scrubbing his tires in, his new tires, and he put his levers down. And man, when I rode it, you know, stunting and everything, he used to jump around the bike and they didn't really care where the levers were just as long as they worked. Um, but shit, ripping, really riding back roads, having those controls down, that made a lot of difference, I didn't even think about. The headlights went out last time I rode. Uh, start the bike. So, I tried to replace them with white headlights, but they sent me some old blue boys. I rode it last night. 
it is so much of a color I can't really see. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to change that. But for right now, we got blue jumping off. Chase, you, you down the lead? Uh, yeah, so I figure I chase you. Oh, do you, do you want me to lead? I yeah, want yeah, I want you to lead one. Okay, yes. Yeah. No, you give me space. Yeah. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, my God. 